Hello and welcome to EF News. As you can see today, Raoul is sick, but fortunately, we have our new anchor, Simon. Uh, can you introduce yourself, please, Simon? Of course. Normally, you know me from lifestyle culture, but now I move to an anchor. Timothy, do you live in a residence? Yes, I do. And did you have to move? Yes, I had to move, but but uh, Caroline will give you more information about that. Hi, it's a Lodi from In the Know. I have a new partner today, it's Francesca. This week's topic, it's the big move. We interview yourself as the housing director. So let's see how they went. Hey, this is EF News in the Know. Mm -hmm. We are talking today with Yusefa about the moving from 407 to 504. Oh, Yusefa, can you tell us more about it? Hi, so yes, um, students are moving from 401 and 407 to 504. Um, basically, the well, as you know, we don't own the buildings in those apartments. We don't own the apartments. And unfortunately, due to complaints from the tenants who are not EF students, um, we are no longer going to have those apartments anymore. Uh, we don't have the leases anymore, so all of the students need to move into 504. So now it's an opportunity for um, everyone to be able to all live together and to really form an EF community in the one building. And the staff members um, who are in 401, Jen and Jackie, they'll be moving in the beginning of December when the last group of students move. So in December, we'll have all staff and all students in uh, 504. And we'll also be having um, internet being put into 504, so free wireless internet for our, everyone, which will be really nice. And we also are working on getting the walls painted and the carpets cleaned, so it'll be a nice, clean environment for everybody. Do you think the moving is really uh, caused by the noise from the students, or do you think it's related with the bus part? Well, I think that um, the main reason definitely is the noise. I've been getting complaints, unfortunately, for many months from the tenants who live in the building who are not EF students, complaining about the f some students who are you know, loud and come back late at night and, um, you know, disturb the other tenants. So that definitely is the main reason. Um, and that's been happening for a long time. And then they just, you know, they realize, okay, enough. We don't want the students there anymore. But it's just, again, like I said, sad that a few students did um, ruin it for everybody. But no, I don't, it's not directly related to the bus party or any of that. We've been getting complaints, like I said, for a while. Yes. Thank you. And if you have problems or questions about your new apartment, you are always welcome in Yusefa's office. Thanks, Caroline. Now, let's hear from the students. Over to you, Francesca. Thanks, Elodie. Yeah, let's talk about the big move. And what I mean with the big move? The residents, of course. Now, let's go talk to some students. So, I found now three students here that live in a 504. So, what do you think about living all together in the same residence? Uh, I think it's good. I think it's better to live in 405 than 401 because 401 had a sm much smaller apartment mm -hmm. and now we can, yeah, I think it's better. Okay. And what about you? Yeah, I think it's better because when everybody lives together you're more social and it's easy to meet friends. And, and you, what do you think? I like it. I think it's cozy. I like it. I love it. So, you have to move to the 504 now. What do you think about I think it's not really a huge problem to move there. The only thing I don't like is that the, the quality of the new apartments from 504 is less than uh, the old apartments. So, I don't like that. But they're working on it. And with all students in one apartment, it can be cool. I don't know. We have to see. But... I'm open for it. Also, one of our staff members left. You know who I'm talking about. It's Andrea. So, she had some final words to say. Let's listen. And we are now in the office from Andrea. Andrea is leaving, so I'm going to ask why. Hi, Andrea. Hi. First, we're going to miss you, oh. of course. But we, no, we want to know the reason. What's the reason why you are leaving? Um, well, I really enjoyed working with you guys and working for EF, but I'm just looking for a new experience. Okay, is that the real reason? <laughs> yes, it's the real reason. I'm definitely going to miss all of you guys, and I would like to thank you guys for making this a great experience for me. Goodbye, Andrea. We'll miss you. This has been Elodie from Indian Note. 
Timothy, do you know what it is this week? I've heard it's Thanksgiving. Yeah, and the school is giving a Thanksgiving dinner. Really? Yeah, uh, but more from Kaiser and Sandy from Lifestyle and Culture. Over to you. Kaiser, do you smell that? Yeah, it's turkey all over. I think it's this way. We should go and look. Hello. Hi. 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 Now we are here with Paloma. She cooked the Thanksgiving dinner. Along with the students. <laughs> the students in the food and wine class have been cooking as well. Do you know what we're having for Thanksgiving dinner? Yeah, we're going to have turkey and chicken, pumpkin pies, um, stuffing, green beans, sweet potatoes, mashed potatoes, cakes, um, pies, apple pie. So a lot of And all that for only two dollars? Yeah. That's very nice. I'm excited. Good. Yeah. It'll be fun. Ricardo, are you go to the Thanksgiving dinner? Of course, I need to go. <laughs> and do you know something about Thanksgiving? Yeah, I know. It's a family dinner where you uh, go with your friends and your family. It's very nice. Yeah, it mm -hmm. is. Hi, Jennifer. Hi, Kaysen. Are you coming to the Thanksgiving dinner today? Yes, of course I'm coming. Are you excited? Um, yes, I am. <laughs> yeah, me too, because we only paid $2. Yeah. <laughs> See you at the Thanksgiving dinner. See you. We are ready for the Thanksgiving dinner. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Back to you, Simon and Timonte. Mmm. Mmm. Thank you, Kaiser and Sandy. Timothy, your hair looks bad today. Really? Yeah. You should go to a hair salon. No, I think it's not so bad, actually, no? It is. Maybe you can learn something in fashion about it. Part 2 of last week's hair report. Over to you. Hi, this is Eva from the news. Um, I'm in Ariana with the hair salon. Yeah. Um, I'm going to ask you some questions. question. Uh, what should I hope to find? Well, we have arranged everyone in the hair and we all have to eat, which means we can all get any time for one. It's kind of hard to win your stuff. We do all sorts of services, ranging from haircuts, uh, highlighting, low lighting, all of the colors, color corrections, hair straightening. We are all independent, so we work straight to straight. We are haircuts for around $50. All over color is about $60. Highlight time and I'm holding it. Hair straightening is about $2. Uh, an hour because they're the ones that are going to take you to the hair extension. Yeah, Thank you.